a big hello from Mumbai. Yes, I am in Mumbai city, which I still very lovingly call Bombay. And the good news is that I am in the city's only farm to table restaurant called Mass. I have heard some amazing things about this restaurant. And the beautiful thing is that everything served on the table in this restaurant is fresh and it's seasonal and it's local. So if it's not in season, it's not on the menu. Like this drink over here, which I'm starting off with today, it's called Maverick and it's got grapefruit, lemon, egg white, Bacardi gold and Himalayan honey cheese. Like he says, it is a very very unique drink. This is a drink you must have if you come to this restaurant. I have to say that I am also very fortunate to be invited by the very talented chef Pratik who heads this restaurant to try out some very unique dishes at the restaurant today. Dining in mass is an overwhelming experience, I've been told. And the unique thing about the restaurant is that the first course happens inside the kitchen. So I'm going inside the kitchen now where the humongously talented Chef Pradeep is waiting for me to give me a taste of his first course which is of course going to be the most sustainably sourced in I'm very intrigued and very, very excited. Let's go. Hello, Chef. Hello, Chef. Thank Hi. you so much for this experience that I am about to experience. This so whole much. experience coming to come inside your kitchen itself is so unique. I mean, I haven't done this in India at all. Um, see, it's really, it's really a very important part of our experience because uh, this is where the dining starts. Uh, our first course is inside our kitchen. Uh, the guests come in to our restaurant and they come straight to the kitchen, have their first course, and then uh, they move back and then the entire course is started. Then the whole experience starts. Okay. So this this becomes very, very important. Uh, we talk about our philosophy, we talk yeah, about yeah. Uh, what we do and why we do and how we do. So everything, every chit chat becomes a very uh, fun uh, interaction. It becomes very, really, you connect with the guests. So yes. that's very really important yes. for us as well. Yes. Our first course is inside the kitchen. Yes. And since you're here, we'll, we're going to give you a first course. Yes. Some oysters. Oysters come from Kerala. So these are oysters from Kerala. In Kerala, we do a reduction of uh, soy. Uh, and uh, coriander roots, uh, coriander roots, so a little bit of uh, uh, you know, paprika, fresh paprika, and then we just make a, uh, a dressing out of it. So first time in my life ever, I'm having oysters in India, from India, with this amazing seasoning. I love the coriander. The amalgamation of everything is just brilliant. This is such a unique experience to dine inside. Not really dine inside, but even just to have the first course inside the kitchen. You know, it's it just brings out this very interesting connection with the food and the people who make food. So what we have, we start you off with a few snacks and these are two snacks from our new menu. Mm -hmm. uh, we do a donut of uh, a chicken, so it's a confit chicken mm -hmm. uh, with a few spices and then we do an active charcoal pillow of uh, avocado and uh, a sauce which is made with uh, chocolate. Oh. So we request you to please use your hands for this course. This is like a melt in your mouth kind of a dish. The sauce on top mixes with 
with this whole little uh, chicken that is stuffed inside. And you know the fact that everything is locally sourced and sustainable and everything, you can feel it when you taste the food over here. So we do duck in two different ways. Okay. Uh, we have a duck uh, breast, which is sous vide, mm -hmm. and then we just like pan sear it, and then we have this uh, duck leg, which is confit, mm -hmm. and then it's just stuffed in a cabbage leaf. Okay. We have these shallots, but these shallots are called pran, and pran is a shallot right here out of Kashmir, and it is only grown in that region. And then we do a reduction, we do a sauce of the duck. The duck sauce, and then we do an oil, but it's a burnt uh, wood oil that we do with it. So it is a burst of uh, smoky flavors. That's our duck. So my third course at Mass has arrived, and I've got a duck on my plate, uh, which is done in two different ways, which Chef Pratik just explained. But what I really want to try are these shallots. These shallots are uh, unique to Kashmir in India, and they're called pran, and I really want to try that. <laughs> And uh, the duck, of course, is also locally sourced. It is from um, Manasar, a place which is from the northern part, uh, in the northern part of India. What I really like in this dish is that oil that the chef put. The, it's, it's got the smoky flavor, so it just enhances. So you've got a lot happening in your mouth inside. You've got the duck, then you've got the sauce. And um, the, the oil, which just adds a burst of flavor with its smoky smell and now I'm going to really try this unique shallots called Pran. Oh my god! Yes, it's a shallot all right but it does have a very distinct flavor to it. So we get our beautiful uh, passion fruits from our own farm which is right outside Pune. Um, so this is a passion fruit kind of creme brulee that we do, but it's in a very foamy format. We pass it through a canister. It's very light. Underneath we have a caramel which is made with whey, and then we have a chocolate, a chocolate which comes from Pondicherry, a sorbet of that. So you need to take the spoon and dig deep inside and then. So the dessert at Mask is here. Mm. Yes, the flavor is complement each other so well in this dessert. It, it just so nicely merges with each other and just an explosion of flavors in your mouth. And it's just enough because I'm not a very kind of a sweet person, so this is just the perfect size of dessert for me. Winding up and a beautiful, beautiful meal at Mask and I'm really glad I, you know, discovered this place because to me food is all about where it comes from and this restaurant just embody, embodies this whole connection to the soil. It sort of takes you back to the soil and the whole experience is just beautiful. The flavors are authentic. For me, this is a restaurant that you must dine in when you're in Mumbai city. Live, love, explore.